Hey everybody, check this out. This is a inlet manifold on a 1KD FTV after about 20,000 kilometers. The inlet manifold was clean and it's got a plate with a seven mil hole, I believe. Yep, you can see that that's there, which reduces the flow of the EJR gases through the EJR cooler. I'm not talking about whether you should do it or not. I didn't do it. I'm not saying it's a good or bad idea in this video. I'm just showing you the results. It's a quick video to show you what happens. So about 20,000 Ks ago, this had a inlet manifold clean and you can have a look for yourself. Come on, hit the like button for the camera work at least. All right, look at that. And that's how it's gonna stay. We've seen them forever. They stay like that. A little bit of light uh, dusting still. If you want to get rid of that and have it 100% clean, then you need to shut off your EJR valve, set it at 0%. Bada bing, bada boom. And I'm not saying you should do that or not in this video, but if your EJR cooler was like, um, if it did happen to leak, one of the very super rare ones, it's got coolant. See, coolant hoses. All right. Coolant in there because exhaust gases come through the port in the head in here and back out there and they need to cool it down because they didn't want it that hot. But internally, if that leaks, it can put coolant this way, which goes into your intake, into your engine. Okay, this is the part that might get dirty because you've still got a little bit of oil in your intake and this outlet here, there's not much flow going on and they can get a bit dirty here. So if you get a P0400, again, very rare, this could be the problem here. This is starting to block up. So it's something that might need maintenance every now and then to remove the EJR valve off the top and give this a bit of a scrape. It's not going to be blocked inside there. This one will look particularly worse because this engine, unfortunately, in the 300,000k range has got a cracked piston. It did have a set of uh, Bailey's injectors before the recent replacement 20,000k's ago. And uh, we don't know what the history was before that, but it's probably previous, you know, it's just the way it's been used, combination of factors and those injectors probably. But anyway, you know, those old flog injectors. Um, but I just wanted to show you so you know for yourself, so you can make whatever decision about, you know, plates with seven mil holes or not, or zero percent, or just leave it alone, or whatever you want to do. Just want to show you the results. That will stay clean like that forever. There you go. There was a quick video. Let's shut this one down before we waffle too much. Subscribe, turn the bell on if you don't want to miss the next one. Catch up.